Hey guys, it's the Gaming Seed. Welcome to Mario Kart 7 Walkthrough Part 3. And I selected the Swooper again. In this part, we're going to cover the Star Cup. Piranha Plant Slide, Wario Shipyard, Neo Bowser City, Maka Woohoo. Let's do this. So, like I pretty much just said, the first track is Piranha Plant Slide, which is my second favorite track in the game. It is like... It's basically a clone of Koopa Cape. It just reminds me so much of Koopa Cape from Mario Kart Wii, which is actually in this game as a retro track. But, yeah, you have like these underwater sections. You have like an underground, well, this underground part, just like the flowing river kind of reminds me of it, I guess. Yeah, you got like these sections with the Goombas. And then there's like this section's like completely new. I like the new ideas that were in this game, like, for tracks and for mechanics, like, you know, like, gliding, you know, what the, what, what? Mario Kart physics for the win! Okay, then. <laughs> that was, like, that was too weird. See, so yeah, out of here, you can, like, do this bit of a shortcut, and you can go through the gap in the fence. So, yeah, not much to talk about. I got three bananas behind me. Green shell, first place. Yeah, over there you can get, like, an easy three coins. If you take the middle. But it's kind of risky because the piranha plant might get you. Um, and if it does get you, it basically f puts you into the river, which forces you to not take that route. <laughs> but seriously, though, what was what was that that happened on the in the pipe on lap one? I don't get it try to trap the glider ramp right there oh, and all that waterfall ruined my shroomless shortcut actually no nah, no nah, it didn't <laughs> oh there's a mushroom there from a goomba I'm gonna get that next lap actually no i'm not <laughs> just gonna take that shroomless shortcut again pretty helpful shortcut too um And I think I got, like, hit by a red shell or something, which is why I only had one banana behind me there instead of two. But, man, I meant to hit that, like, water thing that lets you go onto the top route. There's, like, a boost ramp there. I'm just gonna throw that green back into the abyss. Because it doesn't matter. And there's a red chasing me, but it's too slow, so I'm going to take first place on my second favorite track. Very, very nice. So, yeah... I'm only gonna tell you the standings in like the final after like the final race. I guess. But yeah, next track is gonna be Wario Shipyard. It's another track I kinda like. Not really one of my favorites in the game, but I like it. I like Wario Shipyard. So yeah. This track actually kind of proves a point about Nintendo. They've actually gotten off of making Wario's track stadiums because there was like three of them in a row, and then Mario Kart Wii had Wario's gold mine, and everybody was like, finally a Wario track that's not a stadium. And then they have this, so they're kind of like getting into new ideas for Wario's tracks. Or at least I think so. So yeah, you got like out of the water, and then you go right back in. After this ramp. And you want to go up here because there's like three boost panels. And then there's a ramp here that you can trick off of for like a bit of a boost. It's like a bit faster. Wow, like everybody had mushrooms there. I don't know why I'm saying like a lot, but. <laughs> Oh god, there's a red chasing me. And the pipe bumped me out of the pipe. The pipes there bumped me out of the other pipes there. See, so yeah, a Koopa Troop is gonna pass me. I haven't really seen much of him in the Star Cup. Then again, it's old. this is only the second race. <laughs> um, I got triple bananas. I kind of wanted a, a red shell or even a green shell or a mushroom, but whatever. Whatever, I'm just gonna pass Koopa Trooper right over here. Take that ramp. But yeah, like... 
when I said, like, everybody had mushrooms, and there I go with the like again. What? <laughs> but, anyway, so... Six out of the eight people had shrooms on lap one when I took that ramp shortcut, so I said, um... Wow, like, everybody has shrooms. Okay, I am going to try to make it a vow. I am not going to say the word like for the rest of the video. Not counting when I just did. Uh, crap, blue. And I bet this is gonna... Uh, never mind. <laughs> I'm just thinking of something. It's a pretty old YouTube walkthrough that I watched. Well, I've only I only watched, like, a little bit of it, but... I watched, like, moments from it, and I know what happened. So, first place. When am I not going to get first place? The Mushroom Cup. <laughs> but, anyways, so, yeah. I'm in first with a six-point lead right now. Going into the third track, and that's actually really good to have a six-point lead going into the third track. Because... Yeah, so anyway, now we're on Neo Bowser City. It's a pretty, um, new idea for a track, having a Bowser track that's not a castle. Even though there is a Bowser's castle in this game. I like the music here, too. It's, um, it's a mix of three different songs. It's the mix of the circuit theme from this game, the circuit theme from Mario Kart Wii, and the Toad's Turnpike theme from Mario Kart 64. Like, here's the Toad's Turnpike theme. Yeah. I thought that was, like, a really creative idea for the music. And they made it sound really nice. Like I said in the Mushroom Cup, I really like the soundtrack of this game. It's very good. Probably not the best Mario Kart soundtrack, but it's good. So, yeah, just throwing bananas. I'm in first place. Oh, why did I hop? Why did it let go of the drift? I was holding the R button. Whatever. See, I'm like neck and neck with Koopa Troopa right here on, um... I... On Neo Bowser City, so... Yeah. Oh, I thought that was gonna blow me into the blue mud stuff. And I'm like, there I go with the like again. Oh, crap. <laughs> but... So, yeah. Taking these tight turns like you do on Shy Guy Bazaar, and it was okay for me to say like there because it fit into the sentence. <laughs> if you know what I'm talking about with that whole other walkthrough thing. And he actually spoiled that vow, like, right at the last second, too. I don't know if you guys know what I'm talking about, because I didn't really give any hints, but... Yeah. See, it's taking, taking the tight turns, and... Oh, crap. Don't hit me off the edge. Okay, good. If that hit me off the edge, I would be so screwed. Well, I might still get first, because, like... Only Koopa. Because only Koopa Troopa would pass me and I could probably still outspeed him. But now Koopa Troopa's bombarding me with fireballs. And usually I have like a five second lead on this track. I only have like a one second lead. So yeah. I'm not gonna like stop talking when I say like again because that just makes the commentary weird. So yeah, I have an eight point lead going into the last race. Which, this last race is very infamous for people glitching on this track. Maka Woohoo. But, I won't be glitching. Or will I? No, I'm just kidding. I'm not gonna glitch. It's also one of the rules in my newly recruiting Mario Kart 7 clan. If you guys have heard about that, and if you haven't, then... Send me a video of some time trials and or some worldwides. I know I'm kind of advertising my own Mario Kart 7 clan right here, but, um, yep. So, yeah, just, like, send me a video by August 8th or something of, like, a few time trials or worldwides, and I'll tell you if you get in the clan, send me your, what your clan name would be and your friend code. 
if you guys didn't watch that video then go watch it because that is a, has a, a lot more detail than this about the Mario Kart 7 clan that's really all I'm gonna tell you right now oh god I wasn't even paying I was paying attention to the camera time and I like bumped right into the wall but yeah I didn't glitch I play fair but I will take this like small shortcut And I like how the music on um, Woohoo Loop and Maka Woohoo is um, a remix of the Wii Sports Resort main theme. I kind of get why, but still. Alright, come on. Red Shell, Red Shell. Fire. Any backspan with me. And wow, those all like fizzed out before they hit him and please hit him. Okay, no. Alright, now Metal Mario and Koopa Troopa are right behind me. I think Metal Mario is like a green shell. Oh, he had a bomb. Hmm. Okay, no one's got the lightning, because lightning on this part is treacherous. Hit Donkey Kong. Hit, hit him, hit him, hit him. Yes! I win. I win because of red shells, but I don't care. I still win. And then I hit Donkey Kong afterwards, so... That was pretty funny. Yeah, I won with a 14-point lead. And I got 40, Koopa 26, Metal Mario 25, DK 21, Peach 15, Luigi 13, Mario 10, Bowser 6. So anyways, that was the Star Cup. I'd like to thank you guys for watching, and I'll see you guys in part 4, where I'll be playing the Special Cup. See you guys then.